सी आई ई टी एन सी ई आर टी प्रेजेंट ऑडियो बुक मैथ्स मेला टेक्स्ट बुक ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स फॉर ग्रेड फाइव चैप्टर नंबर फोर्टीन मैप्स एंड लोकेशन पेज नंबर वन हंड्रेड एंड सेवेंटी वन ऑन द राइट साइड ऑफ द पेज यू आर प्रोवाइडेड विद अ क्यू आर कोड स्कैनिंग विच यू कैन रीच आउट टू द एडिशनल रिसोर्सेज टू दिस चैप्टर we also find a picture of directions north south west east given here finding directions a girl says i visited the bharatpur bird sanctuary in rajasthan and saw an amazing bird called the siberian crane there is a picture of a siberian crane here the boy says wow Do you know that these birds fly all the way from Siberia a very cold place to India The girl replies I wonder how they find their path The boy says human beings also keep track of directions One of the ways we figure out directions is by facing the rising sun let's try Manu is facing the rising sun that direction is dash fill in the blank his left hand is pointing in the dash direction fill in the blank his right hand is pointing in the dash direction fill in the blank which way is west we can find a picture on this page in which a boy is standing facing the sun with his arms open and we can find two more kids standing along with him there is a beautiful poem on this page four little chicks four little chicks of a bird set out to fly spreading their wings they all flew high they flew away from east to west flew north to south without any rest as they flew and explored the land finally they returned home hand in hand with their mother they had so much to share our home is the best beyond compare we can find picture of these chicks sitting with their mother on a branch of a tree note for teachers help the learners in naming the four cardinal directions ask the children to figure out the directions by facing the rising sun also discuss with them other ways of finding directions such as using a compass to spark curiosity you may talk about or encourage the learners to find out how birds find their directions during migration page number 172 bird watching children are at a bird watching camp read the clues and color the tents in the camp accordingly the tent to the west of the road is blue the tent closest to the lake is green the tent north of the green tent is purple the tent south of the lake is yellow now draw a tent to the east of the lake there is a picture in which you can find four tents with a pond and there is a road map of a room write the directions of the following in relation to the girl here we find a picture of a girl standing in the room we can also find picture of a bed cupboard bedside table dressing table almira window with respect to the girl we have to write down the positions with respect to the girl in the blanks provided for window bed cupboard and bedside table page number 
make a drawing of your room and locate the direction in which different things have been placed in relation to you standing at the center of the room make the direction arrow for your room there's a blank space provided for the same write the names of the things that are placed in the following directions east west north south there are blank spaces provided for you to write down the answers zoo trip children be ready at your nearby bus stop by 8 am here there's a picture of a teacher standing with some students on stop s1 the teacher says children be ready at your nearby bus stop by 8 am the school bus will take you to the qutub minar in delhi after that we will visit the zoo by a metro train the street map indicates the bus route with dotted lines the bus will pick up children from stop 1 and stop 2 marked on the map observe the map carefully and help the children board the bus page number 174 bus route the bus will start from the parking area it will go north and then it will take a right turn onto dash road driving in the dash direction to reach stop 1 s1 fill in the blanks provided in the above statement to reach stop 2 within brackets s2 it will turn dash within brackets right oblique left onto dash road driving in the dash direction fill in the blanks in the above statement we have a beautiful picture of various locations here like hospital tinkus and golu's house jaydeep's house basketball court shopping center market road parking area prem's house raju's house children park lali's house rohan's house ravi's house and a park area on both the sides of the picture a whose houses are situated to the east of jaydeep's house dash b mark the route from ravi's house to the children's park c which stop is closer to lali's house dash d golu is running late trace the route to help him reach the nearest bus stop e in which direction would prem have to move to reach stop 2 fill in the blanks provided above note for teachers encourage the learners to read the street map ask them to discuss the distances and directions on the map encourage the learners to ask questions by looking at the map page number 175 delhi metro train stations children will get off the bus at the qutub minar metro station to reach the zoo they need to get off the metro at the supreme court metro station here is the metro map for your reference read the key to the symbols and identify them on the map what do the different colored lines represent mark the qutub minar station on the yellow line and the supreme court station on the blue line on this page we are provided with a metro map of delhi metro in the key given on the map we have one red line second one yellow line third a blue line fourth airport express line fifth green line sixth violet line seventh pink line eighth magenta line ninth one circle represents metro station and tenth 
oval shape with a dot inside represents interchange line. Study the map carefully and answer the questions that follow. Note for teachers. Encourage the learners to observe the metro map carefully. Let them understand what different symbols mean on the map. Discuss with them that the colored lines indicate different metro routes, making it easier for passengers to identify and navigate the routes. Let the learners work in groups to answer the questions. Page number 176 Part A Look at the metro map and trace different routes from the Qutub Minar's metro station to the Supreme Court metro station. Part B Lali says we can take the yellow line and change the metro at Hoskos to take the magenta line. If the children follow Lali's suggestion at which station do they need to change the metro line again to reach the Supreme Court metro station? Part C. Which route has the least number of stations between Qutub Minar and Supreme Court? Part D. Which metro route do you think is oblique R the best way to reach the zoo from Qutub Minar? There is a blank provided for you to write down the correct answer. Let us do. Make a map indicating the different places in your school. Make a key for the symbols used in the map. Hide some objects in these places. Mark the positions where things are hidden with red dots or flags. Now, challenge your friends to find the hidden things by reading the map. A sample map and its key are given here. We find a picture of the school map here and on both the sides we have gate and its symbol. We also have symbol for road, a key for building, tank, hidden objects are marked red. On the right side we have a symbol for wall, we have symbol for fence, we have a symbol for seat, oblique bench, there is a symbol for path, there is a symbol for garden and a tree. Page number 177 Ant Hill in the Zoo To collect food the ant can only crawl along the dotted lines on the grid. The arrows indicate the direction in which the ant can move. There is a grid provided here and there is a dotted line which is representing the path for the ant. We can also find in the picture some eatables kept in a plate. There is an apple, there is an ant and bread. The grid is of 1 by 1 centimeters and there is also a direction board with north, south, west and east. Fill in the blanks here with the distances and the directions in which the ant must move from its starting position. Part A to get to the ladoos, the ant has to crawl 2 cm towards the east. Part B. To get to the sugar, the ant has to crawl dash centimeters in the dash direction. Part C. To get to the bread, the ant has to crawl dash centimeters in the dash direction, then dash centimeters in the dash direction. Part D. To get to the apple, the ant needs to crawl dash centimeters towards dash and then dash centimeters towards dash and finally dash centimeters towards dash. You are supposed to fill up these blanks with the correct answers. 
identify other routes to reach the point where apple is located which one is the shortest page number 178 locating the animals in the zoological park within bracket zoo children observe a map of the zoo drawn on a grid each vertical line within brackets column and horizontal line within brackets row is marked with a number to reach the panda we will start from zero move one step horizontally east and reach the first column move up within brackets vertically one step north and reach the first row the panda is where the first row and the first column meet here we have a map of the zoo on a grid paper and we find various animals at various positions there is also position mark for zoo and the grid is from 0 to 12 in a horizontal direction and 0 to 12 in the vertical direction first move horizontally from 0 and then vertically we write the meeting point of the first row and the first column as 1 comma 1 within brackets to reach the tortoise move dash steps towards east and reach the dash column fill in the blank with the correct answers then move dash steps dash and reach the first dash here also we need to write down the correct answers the location of the tortoise is 4 comma 1 within brackets what is at 1 comma 4 answer the following questions now question number 1 locate the animal at the following positions on the map a 11 comma 11 within brackets dash b 2 comma 6 within brackets dash c 6 comma 4 within brackets dash d 3 comma 10 within brackets dash e 11 comma 3 within brackets dash f 10 comma 9 within brackets dash question number 2 write the position of the following animals on the map a lion dash b elephant dash c tortoise dash d deer dash e panda dash f crocodile dash you are expected to write down the correct positions in the blanks provided question number 3 place dots of different colors on the following positions a 8 comma 3 within brackets red in color b 2 comma 9 within brackets green in color c 7 comma 3 within brackets blue in color d 3 comma 8 within brackets orange in color e 8 comma 6 within brackets black in color f 6 comma 6 within brackets pink in color chapter 14 ends here maths mela you were just listening to this audio book textbook of mathematics for grade 5 narration swarnlata sharma sound recordist virendra rawat production assistant somya malik directed and produced by vimlesh choudhary this audio book is brought to you by c i e t n c e r t new delhi india